I support Trump, you know. So I don't know. I don't think a lot of people really like Trump. The people can go after Trump supporters. Now at 530, a Broward business owner outraged after someone vandalized his store. He's hoping surveillance video will help police track down the person who did it. He thinks he was targeted because he's a vocal supporter of former President Donald Trump. Now Broward Sheriff's deputies are looking into the incident as a potential hate crime. CBS Force Peter Dench has a story from Pembroke Park. Rob Raymond has always been a big Trump supporter. In fact, he likes him so much, he has this big cardboard cutout inside his front door. He never thought, though, he'd have such a negative reaction. Raymond wants to know if this person, who's wearing a hoodie and it was captured on camera overnight outside his business, left behind these disturbing images, a swastika and the words Nazi and convict Trump spray painted on his business. I support Trump, you know, so I don't know. I don't think a lot of people really like Trump. I feel like if there's no... If everything's going to be one-sided, to be honest with you, if everything's just going to be one-sided and the people can go after Trump supporters. Raymond found the graffiti on the walls of his company, Doctors Toy Store Medical Equipment, off Hallandale Beach Boulevard near I-95. He took photos of what he discovered. But it's mean-spirited towards some certain people. Who do you think would do something like this? Uh, Trump haters. For sure. I've always supported Trump. I've always had Trump signs here. I, I still, you know, he's not the president anymore. Raymond has shared this surveillance tape with investigators from the Broward Sheriff's Office. Uh, well, they were wearing a hoodie. I really couldn't make him out. We're going to look at cameras more in depth. BSO tells us investigators are trying to determine if this was a hate crime. Why do you think that person should be caught and punished? Well, because, you know, I don't think you could put up those... Uh, I don't think a swastika, a swastika has anything, you know, anything good. Raymond is baffled, saying someone went out of their way to put a lot of work into defiling his business with these hateful words and images. The message is they don't like Trump. They don't like anyone who supported Trump. The graffiti has since been painted over. Rob Raymond has run this business for the past 10 years. He says he's never been targeted before. He says he's told BSO everything he knows about this incident. If you can help find the culprit, call Broward Crime Stoppers at 954-493-TIPS. In Pembroke Park, Peter Danch, CBS4 News.